Hello, I'm Chris Williams. I blog on a daily basis here on YouTube and also on my syndicated website, musingsofchriswilliams.blogspot.com. And my blog is available on Twitter, if you are my friend on Twitter, and also available on Facebook. And I occasionally blog live on justin.tv for slash Mr. Chris 2004. Now, two topics I always blog about. The bullying I suffered when in university, and the Prime Minister Gordon Brown here in the United Kingdom. Now, I don't know what manna from heaven is, I think it means a blessing of some sort, but tonight, uh, February the 22nd, 2010, bullying and the British Prime Minister are the same issue, and that's what I'm going to talk about in this video blog, so stick with me. Okay, here is, uh, as you might know, uh, the British Prime Minister Gordon Brown has been accused of bullying his staff in Number 10 Downing Street here in the United Kingdom. Uh, but what defines bullying? Well, here is what the Chartered, the, the Chartered Institute of Personal and Development have to say about it. The Chartered Institute of Personal and Development, which represents recruitment experts, defines it as this. Bullying at work involves repeated negative actions and practices that are directed at one or more workers. The behaviours are unwelcome to the victim and undertaken in circumstances where the victim has difficulty in defending themselves. The behaviours may be carried out as a deliberate act or unconsciously. These behaviours cause humiliation, offence and distress to the victim. Indeed, I have Asperger's, my Asperger's syndrome myself and I've been put for the argument for many video blogs that I was bullied while in university. People with Asperger's are regarded as being vulnerable people under the World Medical Diagnostic Criteria uh, and uh, they, they find it difficult to express themselves. I use these blogs as a way to improve my communication skills, but just me talking to myself. I'm more hesitant when I'm with other people, uh, but uh, I find that uh, people try to take advantage of my uncertainty, and uh, when when I say that they are taking advantage of my Asperger's, they then say, "Ah, oh, stop going about your Asperger's." They talk as if I haven't got Asperger's to begin with. But uh, indeed, in the books that I have been reading, I am quite right to say that people are being nasty to me uh, because I am recognised as having difficulty in standing up for myself. Uh, but uh, getting back to the issue with the Prime Minister, some say that as the Prime Minister he should be allowed to get away with bullying people. Well, no, I completely disagree. Although the Prime Minister is accused of hitting people and swearing at them, that's not the type of bullying I was subjected to. I was subjected to uh, uh, decisions that were taken against me that uh, um, the logic behind them was not explained to me. And when I tried to question why the decisions were taken against me. Uh, the person taking the decision just said that uh, he decided uh, to take them. He didn't explain to me why it, why the decision had been taken. And uh, I don't know of anything wrong that I had done uh, for those decisions to be logical. But uh, in the workplace environment, where the Prime Minister is concerned, some say that uh, he is a perfectionist, that he is, that he is alleged to bullying is a sign of uh, frustration that things are not working out for him uh, with his uh, uh, with his premiership. Some say, from what I've heard on the news, that uh, those who bully in the workplace, either what I experienced in university or the Prime Minister, the more, uh, the more aggressive they are, the more insecure they are, that they are underperforming with their job. That's probably true for the Prime Minister. And I feel it's true with the person who bullied me in university, but I did find that uh, he very, very made eye contact with me, and he was often uh, perfuse when I stood up for myself. So uh, I don't, I don't think that uh, he's got superior. I don't think the person who bullied me in university has superiors above him that would pin him under pressure. Uh, I think that uh, he uh, is a case of him being fed up the job and. Uh, 
m misusing his power just for his own personal amusement. But uh, with the Prime Minister, of course, and that the election is at, s is at stake, I've been blogging in recent months as requested by me, my YouTube viewers for my opinion on uh, politics. But I'm quite a bit of a political anorak. As you might know, I've recently finished reading a biography about Tony Blair, and indeed it does say in there the characteristics of Gordon Brown, which doesn't make me at all surprised that he has now been accused of uh, being aggressive and uh, only out for his own personal interests. Uh, but the, the key message of this blog is that uh, all sorts of bullying, whether it's uh, aggressive work ethic by a prime minister or patronisation by a university staff member against someone with uh, a developmental disorder uh, should not be tolerated. And indeed that is something that the majority of people here in the United Kingdom have been saying in uh, radio phone-ins and on web uh, blogs I have been seeing through the course of today. Okay, thanks for joining me for today's video blog, and I hope you will join me for future videos for the next few days, weeks and months. Until next time, it's bye for now. Bye bye.